Hey you guys here again with another video for the Steam Deck. This is The Evil Within 2. This is another game that I purchased via the Steam sale going on right now. Uh, I was going to show you guys the size before I actually start the game. Um, this game is, I believe it's like around the 20 something gigabytes. Let me see. Yeah, no, it's actually 35.75 gigabytes. 35.75 gigabytes. And of course, if you're new to my channel, this game is actually running from my micro SD card just like every video game here. And of course, this is 100% verified to work on the Steam Deck with all the controllers enabled just like it should. So let's go and wait for this to load up so you guys can see how fast it actually loads up here on the device. Loading, of course, from the micro SD card. See that? Very cool. Let me test the logo. Awesome. Ooh, ta tango. <laughs> dun, dun. Yeah, the stem engine. I'm surprised they haven't announced a third game, huh? I wonder what this is about. This pops up every time I load up the screen. I never read it, but it looks like a, one of those error screens. But I don't think it is an error screen because it comes up every time. So, here we are with the game loaded up already. I see that. That was very fast. Uh, we got continue, load, options. Let's go show you guys here in options. Uh, graphics, I got it full screen. Um, 800p, running at 800. 60 frames per second. Uh, gamma 16. Photo view, you can control that film grain. Uh, performance metric is disabled. Over here, this is where the. Okay, got it. I got it. Whoops, got it. Nope, nope, nope. Here, you can control the graphics low, medium, high, ultra. I have it on high. And on high, uh, you can turn a couple things on and off. That way, you can, you know, you have a better, like, for example, motion blur. I disable that. A motion blur camera I disable that um, quality you can leave all that high if you want I don't understand a lot some of the things that you see here I really don't understand <laughs> okay shadow quality I'm leaving it on high and that's it you know everything else is on high the only thing I actually turned off was actually um, motion blur and that's it so let's go and load here um, where I left off, let's go do a save slot. Okay, let's go do that right here. And accept. Dun, dun, dun. So I never played this game before. Never did play it before. I did play part one and I didn't like it. Let me go ahead and fix the camera here for a second. I did play part one. And I did not like it at all. At all, but at all. <laughs> and um, part two, go. never even tried it. Never even tried it, even though I did um, hear a lot of great reviews for this phone. For this phone, for this uh, game. Um, did I already talk to him here? Yep, I already talked to him here already. Um, you know, right now I've been learning how to play this coffee let's gonna drink a little bit of coffee so we can uh, replenish our health right now like I said game is running at high and like you see there the frame rate is a 42 41 which is good you know it's good it takes the edge off there you go and here we can actually upgrade our weapons or create ammo with every the stuff that we collect there in the while we're exploring, crafting upgrade weapons, firepower. I don't think I have enough firepower stuff to actually see. Yeah, I don't think I have enough ammo capacity. Yep. Okay, there you go. I got to change that. Nope, can't. Right now, crafting uh, ammo. Go and create a. Uh, at least nine ammo. There you go. Let's 
And that's it. that this game actually has like a very cool like sci-fi theme in it and I didn't expect that from this game like I said the first one feels so much different from this one uh, in this game you're actually being like loaded into this world like like uh, like the matrix or like Assassin's Creed you know that you sit down and they transport you to a location that's what's happening here too you right now he's in He's being like transported here via like some system and he's trying to solve a a mystery, a, a problem. I don't want to spoil too much for those that haven't played this game. But it's very cool. It's what very cool. Hey, let me out of here. Look at that creepy ass nurse. What a pleasant surprise. Volume is all the way yeah. up. You again. How are you here? So I guess yeah, she's from part question. one. I have no Regardless, idea, but I guess she's from part one. Face, even if that face has seen far too much. Mm -hmm. You look tired, detective. I can help you get back in shape. Just like before see so she, she says just like before so i guess here we can actually like upgrade our character you got health you got athleticism recovery stealth um but right now i don't have enough see i can't have 14 i only have 14 it costs 15. this costs let me see four thousand see I can't, I can't upgrade health. Yep. This is steady hands. Reduce. Okay, that I can purchase. Okay, so that I purchased. So now later on I can keep upgrading my character. That's good, but that's cool that you can actually upgrade your health. But right now I don't have enough of those things. Green gel. And that's it. So you can stand up. Now when this game loaded up, it actually loaded up at medium settings. And in medium settings, it actually looked good. And it's, it was running very, very steady. 60 frames per second. Very, very steady. Hopefully he can take care of himself. Um, but right now, so like you see here, you drop it down to... Um, you go ahead all the way up to high. And, you know, it's not going to be all the way up to 60 frames per second. Go ahead, go back. See, now we go ahead back to the world where we at. Okay, so here we have a couple missions we need to do. Uh, we need to set a waypoint for that. We're going out with all the freaking monsters at. Right now, I'm trying to find my daughter. Suck it up, James. We've been so worse than this. I can actually find her. We're better armed this time. Or at least we will be once we leave the town. <laughs> Look, 
looks pretty yeah. far away. But it's the only lead I've got. Okay. God, I hope it's Lily. Okay, so let's hope it's Lily. So crazy things are happening here. Look at that. This game, this section right here reminds me a lot of Silent Hill. Let me know in the comments. Doesn't it remind you like like Silent Hill? Some, I think it's Silent Hill 2 or something like that. Look at that. That looks pretty good. What in the hell? <laughs> if it keeps breaking apart like this, there won't be any union to search. I gotta try to find that signal. Mm-hmm. Yep. So right now we gotta try to follow that signal. And we'll cross right there. We got a flashlight. Oh, I think there's a monster over there. Ah, don't climb up. Shit. Oh, fuck. Those things no. are piling corpses up here. Why? Oh, no. Wait a minute. I got an axe here. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. I knew there was an axe there, and when when you use those axes, they actually it actually kills them. It, it it takes their head off at one slice, but then you lose the axe. The axe the axe actually disappears. Okay, we got some gunpowder, right? I think that's some gunpowder, something like that. Uh, we do have a knife. We do have a knife, but you know the knife barely does any damage to them. Damn! Look at that. Got some bullets here. Because the thing is, they, they already send another team, but the other team hasn't come back. So right now we're trying to figure out what's going on. There you go. Load it. He left the guns. He left ammo there. There you go. Um, I think I need some health. There you go. Our health goes up a little bit there. Okay, smoke powder. Bottles. Also pay attention to these things. Medical syringe, they're gonna replenish your health. So I can see the game is actually running a pretty good, you know, pretty good frame rate. Games like this doesn't, games like these, they don't really need to be running at 60 frames per second. Of course, if they can, that'll be marvelous. Uh, on a bigger, on a bigger, bigger system, of course, you could run this at 60 frames per second. Uh, and I'm also, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I can also go to the settings and do some tweakings and make the game run at 60 frames per second. 
if I actually turn a couple things on and off. But, you know, just want to show you guys the experience, how it looks in high. We could go, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and drop it down to medium so you guys can see how it. See this? This crazy stuff here. Now we are at the Marrow Armory. Gunpowder. So right now let's go ahead and try if I want to switch to medium so you guys can see the difference. This is not that much of a difference. Um bum 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 bum. Advanced settings, custom, nope, medium, everything else enabled. There you go. This is now running at medium, right? It should run with better frame rate. You know, for if for a screen this big, honestly, medium is more than good enough. If you tell me, if you want better frame rate, there you go. We got some herbs. Holy crap! Holy crap! Okay, this thing killed me before a couple times. Oh, Ooh. oh my God! There you go. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay, we got pipes. Scary, huh? Holy crap. Ooh. Ooh. So like see that green gel that we were collecting from the dead bodies? That's the gel that you use to actually upgrade your character. I mean, you see, when we were sat down at, at the chair and we can't, we couldn't upgrade our health. Uh, there was like the 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 thing that we were using to upgrade our character was gel, like five thousand four four thousand dollars gel, broken fuse box, stock. Okay, can't fix it then. Nope, nope. I need to solve this. Let's see if I can get it now this time. Oh, oh, oh wait a second. Oh, oh. oh, I got it. Oh, man, that was fast. The first time it actually took me a while. <laughs> the first time I actually took me a while to actually uh, um, solve that. We got that. We got Nice. 
So yeah, look at this. This is running at medium, and it still looks good on the screen. Oh, now we got our shotgun. So make sure you nice. actually come into this building take it. and get your shotgun. And we, of course, we're going to go ahead and put it over here. That way we can switch to the shotgun and switch to the weapon. Nice. Make sure you actually come to this building <laughs> and get your freaking shotgun. We got some shotgun shells there. Cool. And now let's get the hell out of here. Kick the doors out. <laughs> uh oh, this guy. This guy woke up. Sup? Sup? Wanna try some of this? You do? Really? Come and get it. <laughs> oh man, you can feel the power of the shotgun com compared to the pistol. You can actually feel the power of that. So, okay, this video has gone over 20 minutes already. Okay, let's go ahead and there's going to be a couple more. We got. Holy crap. What's up, dudes? What's up? Yeah, what's up? Whew. There you go. <laughs> you got. You can't use all the shotgun. You gotta be a little bit smart because um, I'm pretty sure of these ammo. You gotta be building ammo. Um, they're gonna be scarce. Oh, we got a key here. The key we got for the nurse something. I don't know what nurse something is it. We don't. We can't use this, right? I'm pretty sure we can't. Well, guys, that's it for this video. It's getting long already, but you got to see gameplay for Enemy Within 2. Plays awesomely here on the system. Looks kind of creepy. Very creepy game. Um, got it very cheap. I think it was like six or seven dollars, which is totally worth it if you never played this franchise. Like I have. I've never played this franchise. And so far I'm liking it. I like the atmosphere and all that. And the story so far I'm liking it. So. And it runs nice here. Nice and smooth. Nice and smooth here. Right now this is medium. But you saw how it was running. Um, there you go. We got some more shotgun shells there. Hand, handgun bat shells. I thought it was. Yeah. But. That's it guys. Thanks for watching this video. This was the Evil Within 2 on the Steam Deck. Awesome game. Awesome game. Thanks for watching, guys.